good to see you again and welcome back to Umicom Online Business Training Center where now we're really getting started in stage one web development like I said in the intro we start from absolute basics so what more basic than to understand how the internet works and what is a web page in essence and how to create a very basic website but simply the internet is just a collection of computers connected together we'll illustrate this with this diagram here computers and they all connect together in a network that's it very simple isn't it now we're not going to deal with the hardware side in this course we might do that in a, in a different course dealing how to create a network and all that stuff we'll do that later but for now we're just trying to understand the very basics the building blocks okay so let's make it really simple now let's think of what a web page is a web page is just a document like any document you might have on your computer right now you might have a few letters uh, you, you might have accounts in Excel uh, you've got reports presentations your business plan on the word document um, and, and these are all very good examples of documents they have meaningful names usually to, to give you a, a bit of a hint of what the content of the document is well put simply that is what a web page is it's just a document in fact you don't need any skills at all to create a web page simply go to Word right now and type some text save it uh, but instead of saving it as a Word document click on file and save as and just select web page now add you can do it a different way you can actually save the file and the add the extension at the end dot htm or dot html now htm stands for hypertext markup or hypertext markup language these are the extensions like you've got a word document the extension of it is doc if you've got text document is dot txt and so on okay so each file has a different extension which tells the computer what the content of that file is if it's a, it's a word document it's got dlc if it's just text and uh, it will be txt and if it's a, it's a, uh, a web page it will be htm or html there's other extensions obviously for websites we'll go into that in later detail uh, but for now that's it that's exactly it that's that's all it is what web pages and a website is just a collection of uh, other media uh, other other web pages other documents all in one folder and that folder is usually called a domain now a domain is basically if you think of a room everything in that room belongs to me it's my domain so it's, that's that's it basically a domain is like a home a place where everything inside it belongs to that home and that's it so now let's look at what really happens in the next video